Assalamu alaikum. My name is Kesar Mubarak Amr Sharma and I am from Wan East Timor. I am 11 years old and I am in grade 5. Today, for the Abdus Salam Science Fair, I will be making an experiment called the lava lamp. For the lava lamp, we need vinegar, vegetable oil, baking soda, a stirring stick, food coloring, a jar, and a light, which is optional. Okay, let's start. First, I'm gonna put the baking soda, the base, also known as the sodium bicarbonate, in the jar. Next, I'm gonna fill it with vegetable oil halfway through. Next, I'm gonna put vinegar in the jar, which is also known as the acetic acid. Now I'm gonna switch off the lights and put this lamp on it so we can see what it's doing. Now, as you can see, the acetic acid is sinking down to the bottom and mixing with the sodium bicarbonate and making carbon dioxide, which you see as bubbles coming up, making a lava-like effect. Now, let's discuss the science behind this experiment. In this experiment, we need baking soda. Baking soda is, so, is a sodium bicarbonate, a chemical compound known as a base. While vinegar is also known as a, the acetic acid, which is an acid. When an acid and a base, baking soda, are combined, a chemical reaction occurs. When sodium bicarbonate and vinegar are combined, they react and produce carbon dioxide, a gas which you see bubbles up as soon as the vinegar droplets come into contact with the baking soda. Oil and vinegar do not mix because of polarity. Polarity is a concept used to describe how certain molecules are attracted to or repel other molecules. Vinegar is an acid and its molecules are polar. Oil has non-polar molecules. Polar and non-polar molecules repel each other. Therefore, the vinegar will not mix with the oil, giving you a colorful lava lamp style display. So this was my project for Dr. Abdus Salam Science Fair. I hope you enjoyed it. Jazakallah.